Chapter 24, The Eleventh Hour, Part 1. The time is 11 p.m. You're drifting off into sleep mood when your phone starts ringing. Who could it be? A client is on the line. Remember the conference and exhibition I told you about? I need you to MC the opening ceremony. 9 a.m. tomorrow. Can you do it? Talk about short notice. How do you really prepare well with so little time to the event? Here are critical questions you should get answers to. Are you available? Because you need to be physically present to MC the event. So hang up and quickly flip through your diary. If you're not free on the date and time, too bad. Offer to recommend someone else and go back to bed. However, if you will be available, call back and ask for more information. What information do you need? You need to know what the conference is about, who the audience and speakers will be, and what the program lineup will look like. Ask the organizer to give you a general picture of the event. Confirm from them who the audience will be. Since you will be working at the opening ceremony of a conference and exhibition, the audience is likely to include delegates and exhibitors as well as the media. Ask the organizer to email you the program lineup and brief profiles of all the speakers. How much will you be paid? If you are doing the job as a favor for a friend, skip this question. However, if you are a professional MC, you deserve to be rewarded for your services. Remember, the organizer called you at that late hour because they really needed your services and are expecting you to do a professional job. How do you prepare? You must have enough general knowledge on the conference subject matter to speak intelligently about the main issues. Even if the organizer emailed you a bunch of conference documents, you would not have enough time to read them fully to absorb the contents. Remember the event is less than 10 hours away. What is your solution? Here is what I did when I got a late night request to MC an e-commerce conference the following morning. I went online and headed to YouTube. In the search box, I typed in, what is e-commerce? In 45 minutes, and while putting my clothes together for my assignment the following day, I watched two online videos. The first broke down the concept of e-commerce, and the other featured Jack Ma, Alibaba Group CEO, making a presentation at an international e-commerce conference. Still on YouTube, I searched for e-commerce in Africa and found another conference presentation on the challenges and opportunities of doing online business in Africa. Not bad for a spot of last-minute research. What do you do on the day? 1. Get to the venue at least an hour early. 2. Familiarize yourself with the room and the equipment. Microphone for you, projector for the presenters. 3. Introduce yourself to the speakers and confirm the correct pronunciation of their names. 4. Check to see if there are any changes to the program emailed to you earlier. Make sure you have both soft and hard copies of the speaker's profiles and program. If one version fails, you will have a backup. 5. Establish who your dedicated contact person will be during the event so that information about any changes can flow freely between you and that person. Even though you were not given sufficient notice, you've done enough preparation to ensure a successful event. You're good to go!